A little bit different video here today. We're gonna review a couple things. Is coin roll hunting fake? For one, are eBay sellers tricking people saying that unopened rolls have really not been open? Well, we're gonna test out the theory. We got the twist and crimp coin wrap sealer. So we're gonna make this end, we're gonna fill it up with coins. We're gonna make this end look like this end. See if it actually works. I've never actually used one of these before. And we're also going to test out the coin sorting tray. And after we do it, see if it actually works uh, and see how uh, you know efficient it is. I'm actually going to give this away to someone in the comments below. So comment on this video. You can comment anything you want to say, you know, hi, I like the video or hi, uh, you know, I watch all the time or whatever you guys want to comment. Just one comment and I'll pick a random winner and uh, you guys can email me and claim the prize. I'll show you how to do that. Be very simple. Uh, so I want to give this away. Just want to test it out on video and see uh, how we do. Uh, so if we go to eBay for an example, uh, here's just an example. And I want to stress this. These people could be completely honest. These could be unopened rolls of coins. I'm not saying that they're not. But I'm saying I've searched coin rolls uh, from eBay and some of the rolls, not so good. Some of the other rolls, I've found a, a couple you know, minor mint errors in. So it's all really up in the air of what you believe and how much you trust the seller. So if we look at these, you'll see that it says unopened rolls from estate uh, coin lots. They look like they've been closed. We're going to see if we can actually close a roll uh, that looks very similar to these. And you see that these rolls sell for a lot of money. You got Indian head scent on the end of the roll. Usually it's filled up with wheat pennies inside and an Indian head scent on one side and a wheat penny on the other selling for over 140 bucks. And then here we'll see, uh, you know, rolls, one roll selling for 70 bucks, uh, all different prices. So have these been opened? I really don't know. I would like to really trust these sellers and take their word for it. I hope they're not, uh, you know, uh, trying to scam people or anything. But uh, from my experience, I have found a couple things, nothing really valuable, but I've also went through rolls with, you know, Indian head scents on the end and all of the inside are wheat pennies. So it's kind of, I'm kind of skeptical about it, but uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment, comments below on these. And if you think coin roll hunters, re-roll their coins and stack them with silver. Uh, as you guys know, I never have re-rolled my coins in a coin roll hunting live stream uh, because we've went through boxes and never found any silver. And then we went through other boxes and found a lot of silver. So it's all luck at the end of the day. So let's just get the testing. All right, so I got the coin sorter here. We're gonna put it right back in the box and uh, we'll send you these to whoever wins. So those will come with it. All right, so we got, let's see, we got quarter, nickel, dime, and penny. So we don't want to throw any half dollars in here because they'll probably get stuck in the quarter one. So if we do, let's see, quarters. Do we got any nickel? Yeah, we got nickels and dimes. All right. We're going to just take all this up here. Let's see how good it works. All right. We'll keep doing it here. Get all these half dollars out of the way. I gotta cash these in at the store, at the bank, not at the store. What was I thinking? All right, let's just, here, how about this? We'll do this. Let's scrape it all over here to the side. All right, here we go. When you have a lot of quarters, it looks like it's hard for the pennies to get down and the dimes, so you gotta kind of move it around once it gets filled with quarters, but it actually works. You just gotta give it a minute for everything to pass up these quarters because the quarters are bigger. So look at that. You got quarters, you got nickels, you got pennies, and you got dimes. I think that's pretty cool. Works really well, except for, you know, when you have a lot of quarters on top. But what you can do is you can just take this off and you can just when you're done, when you get all the other coins in there. So, um, well, there's a nickel. There's a nickel up top here. Gotta send that down. 
But other than that, yeah, works really good. Uh, it's efficient, especially if you don't have a bank like mine where you can just cash in your coins into a coin machine. Uh, you know, this might help you to just dump all your coins in here, uh, get them all separated. That way you guys can re-roll them up and take them back to the bank after you search through the rolls. All right, so that actually works pretty cool. We'll put that back in the box and we'll ship it to somebody uh, that comments on this video. So let's do this. We're going to... This is gonna be my favorite part because I've never used one of these. Next, we're going to test out this twist and crimp. So since I've never actually used one of these, it's gonna be fun to see how it actually works and uh, how legit it looks, you know, once you get the end here crimped up. All right, let's get these pennies in here. I got all these shavings on my hand because this is where I scratch my lottery ticket videos. If you guys haven't seen those videos, feel free to check them out on uh, Couch Collectibles on Facebook or uh, on Couch Casino here on YouTube, my other channel. All right, here we go. We're going to open it up. So this has a five for a nickel, 10 for a dime, 25 for a quarter, and uh, I think this is for a penny. Nope, I guess that's dime. I guess this one here is for the penny. All right, so let's see how we actually do it. Put it on there, press and twist together. All right, I'll try it. Let's see it. Press and twist together. Bam! Doesn't look too professional. I think I got some uh, work to do. But, looks very similar to some of the other, um, let's see if that's the right size. Looks very similar to some of the other coins out there. Coin rolls. Definitely not as good as this side. You can look, tell it doesn't look very good, but some of the rolls look like that on eBay. Um, so just beware guys. I don't know, you know, what to trust. Maybe someone that sells on eBay, unopened rolls, can comment on this video and let me know um, more information. Let me know if you guys are legit. I just want honesty in the coin community, of course. I don't really like making these like controversial videos or anything, but I thought it'd be cool to test out and see. I tell you what, we'll give away this also um, to the person who wins the coin tray. So we'll just throw these in. Put them back in here. I don't need them for um, my stuff because I just take my coins to the bank and just throw them into the coin machine and that's it. So whoever wins will win both. And all right, guys, don't forget to subscribe in the middle. Check out the videos to the left of me. And until tomorrow, I'll see you guys in the comment section below. This is Couch Collectibles and this is where I disappear.